Hello, and welcome to another exciting adventure from Narwhal Gaming. I am Doug, and this is Seven Days to Die. A uh, little bit of a confession again. I was out grinding, and I died. Happens. <laughs> Always seems to happen off screen. Um... So I have the option of going to get my stuff. However, there is a dog where I died. Not good. Um, what I want to do though today is go and find a miner's helmet. Uh, I'm getting kind of tired of the switching back and forth between my tools and my flashlight. And it would be nice to have a light mounted right on my head. So we are going to go and head south. Let's go check that out. Of course it's got to be nighttime right now, but that's okay. I've always had luck the most finding these mining helmets in cars. Was that a car? It's so dark I can't even see. It'd be awesome if there's just one right off the bat. Nope. Duct tape. However, you can use duct tape to uh, make a miner's helmet if you have all the rest of the stuff. There, put my... Over there. Uh-oh. Crap. Nope, she's not running. Okay. I think I might not have turned on nighttime running. Yeah, these guys aren't running, so I'm not in uh, in hard mode on this one. Uh, let's see, where am I anyways? There might be a... Maybe a cemetery over here, a church. Oh, yep, there it is. Out of breath. Collect some cotton while we're going. There's some cloth fragments rather. There's some of that. Little Oh, I hear some pitter pattering. Yep, I got spotted. You know what there's cars back there. I don't know how many zombies we have. We got a lot of zombies. One, two, three, four. At least. Oh, five. Didn't see that one. Right, let's go, let's go. Nothing. You can probably tell I don't exactly run in a straight line either. <laughs> and what is this? Is this a car? That's a husk. Okay. All right. Here we are in the uh, the burnt forest. Uh, the burnt forest is a good place to find nests because there's no foliage blocking it. It's also a good place to get coal uh, for your fireplaces and and your uh, cooking material. Uh, there's a burnt guy. Oh, a whole bunch of burnt guys. And oh, we're not going to stop at that car. We're going to check this one. Nothing, of course. Uh, 
Okay, so the place that I'm heading to now is called the Wasteland. Oh, bunny rabbit. It has a ton of cars. Uh, it's more of an industrial area, I believe. So it's got uh, mining equipment. Out of breath again. Stamina. Oops. Probably better off punching a tree. There we are. Fifteen X. I'm actually kind of surprised I didn't run into any dogs back at that little town there. Or I wouldn't really call it a town, but a little group of houses. Okay, now we're on the edge. We got desert on my left here, and then uh, this is still the burnt forest. Desert's a good place to get the uh, the yucca plants, which are good for cooling down. Uh, good for getting sand. Okay, these things here, you don't want to step on these. These will catch you on fire. Uh, it'll also catch anything that walks on it that's not you on fire, like zombies. So if you can lead a zombie onto it, that's good. But it'll give you wood, and I... Might have gotten some coal out of it. Yep, got some coal. Put that right over there. Boom. Oh. Yeah, in the desert, you're going to hear a lot of screaming in the darkness, too, because rabbits like to get caught on cactuses. And uh, it's not pleasant. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh, that sounded gross. I got a what is this? A steel axe. Yes, please. Oh, that there. And like I said, axes aren't really weapons. You can use them to clobber, but they aren't the greatest. You want something that bludgeons. Oh, another axe. Popular item over here. Alright. Oh, there she is. Oh, has a bonus for heading towards the backpack, too. So, if I live through this, we'll be able to uh, possibly get our stuff back. Okay, so this is the wasteland. Uh, it's an area you have to be careful in because there are landmines pretty much everywhere. But you get a lot of free resources just laying on the ground. That's 15 iron. Nothing. And the landmines look like... Oh, dang it. Oh, crap. I hear a dog. Not good. Landmines look like uh, hubcaps. Hello, miss. Man. 
I don't have a club. I'm gonna go. Oh no! Okay, here's the intersection. This way, I guess, for a second. Okay. Pick up yucca. Oh, egg. Uh, nest, rather. Nah. Feathers. Okay. Uh, yeah, you can eat yucca straight up, or you can make them into things. I'll just eat that straight up. I don't... Make a club. Ah, dang it. Make a barbed club. I need forged iron for that. Steel reinforced club would be nice though. Need a lot more iron. We're getting a little bit of sunlight now so we can get into that industrial area. Trying to be speedy. <laughs> Ooh, <man. sighs> oh, crap, geez. Ah, didn't I just kill you? Or is that a different one? That might be a different one. Away. All I want is a helmet. Or a miner's hat, rather. Although a helmet will work because you can use a uh, helmet to make a miner's helmet. some healing this is not looking good I still have this guy after me Those dogs growl.
All right, so it's obvious I'm going to have to prepare a little bit more before I can head down and get my stuff uh, and get a miner's helmet because I keep getting attacked by dogs. Um, but we will work on that next time. I'm going to do a little more grinding off camera, build up my supplies, and also going to build some clothes. You've seen me do all that before. Uh, build armor. And then uh, next time we'll head out and see what we can find. And I'm going to have to mark those locations on my map unless I find my backpacks during my uh, my grinding. So uh, until next time, I am Doug with Narwhal Gaming. And this is, has been 7 Days to Die on the PlayStation 4. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe and like and all that stuff, I guess I'm supposed to say. And we will see you next time. I think I hear a zombie. Yep, I see two of them. Okay. Uh, bye.